Hello everyone, welcome to Tiago with Lu Qin. I'm Lu Qin. This is our lovely dog, Fred. Today, I will guide you through a 25 minute full body gentle flow. We will pretty much on the ground the entire sequence, no up dog and down dog, easy on the wrists. It's great for beginners and experienced yogis. Grab a block and let's get started. Take a comfortable seat, easy cross-legged position. Take a block. It helps to relax the hips and lengthen the lower spine. Sit with your spine nice and tall. Relax your shoulders away from your ears. Tuck your chin slightly to lengthen the back of your neck and project the crown of your head up. Now, close your eyes. Bring up that joyful smile. Begin to find your breath. Find your calm. Find your heart at ease. Notice the air comes in and out through your nostrils. We're going to recite these four lines silently with each inhale and exhale. Breathing in I calm my body. Breathing out, I smile. Dwelling in the present moment. I know it is a wonderful moment. Blink your eyes open. Take your hands behind you. Make a fist and bring it to the left side of your waist. Neck stretch to the left. Draw the left ear towards the left shoulder. Hug the left elbow towards the midline. And now, take the right ear to the right shoulder fist to the right side of the waist, hug the right elbow behind. Release your hands, palms on your thigh, neck row, clockwise. Slowly and mindfully, Loosen up every muscle fiber on your neck. Always keep the spine nice and tall. Counterclockwise. Bring your head back to center. Come to a tabletop position. Stack your shoulders over your wrists and hips over your knees. Spread your fingers wide. Press down each pad of the fingers. A good option is to make a fist. Press the knuckles down. This helps to take away the pressure on the wrists and easy on the shoulders. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly and lift your gaze. 
Exhale, round your spine. Cat. Gaze to your navel. Press down the tops of your feet, and follow your breath. For the next cat pose, tuck the navel. Draw the hips towards the right side, and then move them towards the left. Back to a call. For the next cat pose, draw the navel in and send the hips towards the left heel. And then draw them to the right. Two more cycles of cat and cow. This modified cat pose loosens up the psoas muscles. Really helps to release tension in the lower spine. Depending how your lower spine feels at this moment, you can decide the range of motion. Back to a neutral tabletop. Step the right foot forward to a low lunge. Press down the left fingertips. Lift your chest. Now reach the right arm up. Easy twist. Turn the right triceps towards your face. One more breath. Lower the arm. Send the hips back to a half split. Press down your fingertips. Keep the spine lifted, nice and lengthen. Stretch the hamstring. Press down the heel. Flex the ankle. You might fold over the front leg. Even walk your hands beyond the foot, adding the stretch to the lower spine. Back to your palms and bring the leg back. And then come to stand on your knees for gate pose. Step the right leg out, foot parallel to the short edge of the mat, left hip directly over the left knee, reach the arms out to a T, then send the left fingertips down, right arm up. Press into your hips, press down the top of the left foot and the short edge of the right foot. Options to lift the right toes off the mat, adding the element of balancing. One more breath. And change. Arms out. Left arm to the sky. Lift up through the left knee, all the way through the left pinky. Bring the arm closer to your ear. Inhale, bring the arms out. Exhale, bring the leg down. Come to a hero's pose, sitting on your heels. Then move the hips off the heels to the left. To begin, we're sitting a little awkward, but this will give us a deeper stretch. Reach the arms out, and then left arm reaching up. Right arm cross over 
your belly. Sit tall and lean back a little. Feel the stretch from the left sits bone through the tip of the hip, through the ribs, the armpit, all the way through the tip of the pinky. We are stimulating the heart meridian. One more breath. Lower the arm. Extend the right leg straight. Ankle flexed. Take inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, hinge your hips. Head to knee, forward fold. Press into your palms and lift your chest up. Step the left foot over the right leg. Right elbow to the outside of the left knee. Left arm up and bring the fingertips behind. Twist to the left. Elbow against the knee. Back fingertips supporting the spine. Each inhale, lengthen your spine. Each exhale, twist a little deeper. Press down the entire right leg. One more breath. Turn your chest forward to staff pose. Ankles are flexed. Sit tall. Bend your knees a little. Take inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, hinge your hips. Rest the palms on the mat. Press into the lower spine. Then press down the entire leg. Release the entire chest down. Bring your head to between your legs. Release the spine. Lift your chest up, come to a tabletop position. Step the left foot forward to a low lunge. Reach the left arm up, easy twist. Options to lift the back knee off the mat. One more breath, lower the arm and the back knee, send the hips back, half split. Front ankle flexed. Very nice stretch for the hamstring. You might stay here or fold over your leg. Walk the hands forward, adding the stretch for the lower spine. Press down the top of the back foot, 
engage the quads. Press down the front heel. Active stretch. Back to your palms and draw the leg back. Stand on your knees. Prepare for gate pose on the second side. Step the left foot out. Right hip directly over the knee. Foot parallel with the short edge of the mat. Options to lift the toes up. Press down the back, uh, press down the top of the back foot. Arms out to a T. Reach the right fingers down. Left arm up. Press the hips forward. Lengthen the hip crease. Reach the left fingertips up. One more breath and change. Send the right arm up to the sky. Lift up from the right knee and stretching through the entire side body. Feeling the stretch on the lower spine on the right side. One more breath. Release the arms and bring the leg back to hero's pose. Move the hips off the heels to the right side. Prepare for the awkward stretch. Arms out. Then send the right arm up, left arm across your belly. Turn your chest slightly towards the sky. Bring the arm closer to your ear. One more breath. And over the arm. Extend left leg straight. Ankle flexed. Sit tall, reach your arms up, take inhale, exhale, hinge your hips, fold, head to knee, fold over the leg. Engage the entire leg. Press down the back of the heel. Lengthen the chest forward. One more breath. Walk your hands back, lift your chest up. Step the right foot over the left leg. Sit tall, left elbow to the outside of the knee. Bring the right arm up, then behind, supporting the spine. And twist, gaze towards the right shoulder. Press down the entire left leg.
while Mobra turned the chest forward, release the legs, staff pose, sit nice and tall, inhale, reach the arms up, exhale, hinge your hips, fold, Press the lower spine forward. Bring the chest closer to your knees and rest the belly on the thigh. The purpose of this stretch is to lengthen the lower spine so you can bend the knees to any amount. One more breath. Walk your hands back and lift your chest up. Come onto your knees. Prepare for camel pose. Palms behind you, lower back. Hug the elbows in. Open your chest, then Press the hips forward. Feel the shoulder blades drawing towards the midline. Press down the top of your feet. Keep the chin tucked a little. You might stay here only if it is in your practice. Reach the fingertips towards the heels. Stretch into the hip crease. Palms supporting the spine. Come to hero's pose. Bring the palms in front of you. Now round your spine as much as you can. Bring the knees together. Come to a cat pose and rounding the spine, sending the hips towards the heels. Walk your hands forward. Rest your forehead on the mat. Place the tip of your tongue on the roof of your mouth. Engage the Qigong breathing techniques. At the end of the exhale, pull the pelvic floor up. Observe three cycles of breath. Press into your palms, lift your chest up. Bring your palms to heart center. Gaze at your fingertips. Bring your thumbs to the third eye. May this practice and beyond bring you peace, joy, and contentment. Namaste.